first step for heating. This is the fitting and slowest step. If a sparker is right-handed, it's necessary to step up from the left leg and completely opposite for the left-handed player. The second step. You should step up, throw both arms behind you and then to the sides for making backswing. The third step. It consists of two steps, stall and side half step. A player needs to stop rapidly and sit slightly for future jumping. A short distance should be between feet. It's near 50 or 60 cm. Take a breath. Swing up. To swing arms helps to increase jumping and keep the balance for player. For this, it's necessary to throw both arms back as far as possible. Jumping. Push off quickly. It's very important to avoid spreading out legs over rise, because a player can lose the height of jumping. Legs should be parallel to each other. Swing. A player strips trunk and gets a numb if he right hand into his back for a taking hit. And left arm moves up and straight ahead like the aim. The important item is not lay down the elbow lower than shoulder and attack on the maximum height. The ball should be behind the head. It should be in front of the player. In this case, the player can control the direction of hitting and attack correctly. The control of the court. It's necessary to look at the opponent's court by side vision to see empty zones for spike. The hitting. The player strong swings around himself. Then the shoulder of attacking arm connects. When it becomes straight, start to hit the ball. Breathe out and don't forget to bend hand to avoid a ball out of play. If a hand relaxed during the hitting, it will allow to make a slash like a whip. Landing. A player should control his body. It's necessary to get down on half bent legs to avoid any contact with the net or going into the opponent's court. If you like our video, please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for latest updates. Don't miss our new starting videos.